All right, guys, I'm just doing a real quick video. Um, in my live stream last night, I made a little mistake and told you guys some false information. I never want to do that. I'm actually doing most of these videos to clarify a lot of um, misinformation. So this is regarding this Rock 1 trigger. As I mentioned in my stream last night, this is a double hook. Now, with traditional double hook AK triggers, you have to have what's called a double hook cut in the bottom of the receiver. So protruding forward from that little square hole in the bottom that the trigger comes through, there should be a little groove, one for single hook, two cutouts for double hook. I didn't realize until last night, this is the first time I've installed a Rack 1 on a single hook receiver. These actually are also compatible with a single hook receiver. Now, they've done something new with these where there's a special relief cut where even though there's still two hooks, if you will, that interfa interact with the hammer, they've modified the angle a little bit where these can be installed in a single hook receiver. I had told you guys last night that you would have to modify your receiver or modify the trigger. This is not the case with the Rack 1. This is actually compatible with both. So just wanted to hurry up and clarify that. I'm sorry for giving anyone any bad advice yesterday. I just really don't want to be out there spreading any false information. And yeah, so far, this seems like a really good trigger. I've been using these for over a year now, maybe maybe almost two years. And they seem to be really nice triggers. And that's another cool feature of it is the fact that this can definitely be installed in a single hook receiver. So, and, and you kind of get the trigger pull benefits of a double hook. So, just wanted to correct myself and admit that I was wrong. And I'm going to be wrong from time to time, but I don't want to let any false information stand in any of my videos. So, thanks for watching, guys, and have a good one.